Ardsley, New York is a small, quiet town. People get along. It has good schools. Nothing much happens. People thought of it as a safe place to live, until the Carrasco case. The Carrascos had a nice house on a quiet street, Grove Lane. Paulina worked late, and she did all the housework, while her husband Adonis sat around and drank. It was known throughout town that they didn't get along much anymore. Adonis was very abusive to Paulina. And he had a mistress named Martha, who Paulina didn't know about. The Carrascos okay. also had a two-year-old baby named Trey. All right, I gotta go to work. Whenever Paulina wasn't home, Martha would come to the house to spend time with Adonis. Hey, Martha. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm chilling. Yeah, 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 she left, you can come over. You can come over now. Yeah, it's good. Can't wait for you. What's up, baby? How you doing? Hey, baby, how you been? I've been good, I miss you. I wish we could spend more time together. Me too, baby. How's Paulina? Are you gonna leave us soon? Don't worry about Paulina. I'm gonna take care of her soon, and me and you can be together. Yeah, hello, 911. Uh, my neighbor Paulina, I just heard gunshots from her house, and her husband's very abusive, so I think she, he shot her. Calling all units. We have a 1071 on Grove Lane. That shot's fired. I'm on it. To the police! Please open the door! Oh! We're gonna need a forensics team. Detective Aaron? One gunshot to the head? Alright, I'll be right there. How's it going, officer? <laughs> what do we got in here? It's a bloodbath. I'll check it out. Looks like someone had a rough morning. I'll go get my kit.
Dana here walked in from the door and was immediately shot in the head. The blood splattered on the floor, on the shelves, and on the ceiling. And it looks like the shooter dropped the gun right here. All right, it's time to collect the blood evidence. Ooh, that's some good blood. Seal that up, take it back to the lab. Oh, found some carpet fibers here next to the gun. These could definitely be from our shooter's house or from his car. All right, I'm gonna collect this gun, bring it back to the lab, and check it for fingerprints. You're right, officer. It's a bloodbath in there. Yeah. I've heard the rumors about this couple, and I think it was the husband of Adonis that did it. We gotta find that guy. Hey, there he is. Hey, numbnuts. You Don Carrasco? Yeah, what's up, dog? I need to take you down to the station and ask you a couple questions. What? Why? Just gotta go. No. Well, we need to call a lawyer. You go take Adonis down to the station. I'm gonna take this evidence back to the lab. Here we are in the lab. I just ran those fibers we found next to the gun, and they came from a Toyota Camry, the same car that Adonis has. It's not looking too good for him now. We just got to uh, run this blood sample and check this gun for fingerprints. Where were you on Friday, April 3rd? I was shopping. Shopping, huh? Why don't you tell me about how you killed Paulina? I already told you guys I have nothing to do with this. So that wasn't your gun at the crime scene? Hey buddy, I can keep you here all night. You got nothing on me. Well, I just ran these uh, blood samples here, and not a surprise, they belong to Paulina. So now we just gotta check out these fingerprints. All right, now we're going to check for fingerprints on this gun that was found at the crime scene. Let me get my fingerprint powder here. Get a little on that. All right. Oh, looks like we got a print. Yep, we definitely got a good print on there. Oh yeah. All right, now we'll just have to run that through the system. All right, well, we just ran these uh, fingerprints, so we're about to find out whose prints were on that gun. I suspect it was the husband of Adonis. Let's check it out. My God! It wasn't Adonis. He wasn't the killer. It was his mistress, Martha. I gotta go tell the police. Is your name Martha Smith? Yeah. We're going to come down to the station with us right now. Oh my god. I'm going to ask you a couple questions. <sighs> so Martha, where were you on Friday, April 3rd? I was uh, at my grandmother's house. Oh really? So why were your fingerprints used on the gun to kill Paulina? <laughs> ah! I admit it! I killed Paulina because I love her husband Adonis! <gasps> Goodbye, Paulina. You're a murderer. You killed Paulina. You're going to jail. Keep it moving. <laughs> the evidence says you're innocent. Free to go. Hey, I'm sorry about Paulina. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. 